How to connect any desk to another computer. Well, that is what I'm going to show you guys in this pretty quick and easy tutorial. So it's actually very easy to do. So if this video helped you out, let me know in the comments. But let's get started right away. So all the way at the top, you can already see your address. Now, all the other computer has to do is simply um, fill in your address and then click on connect. By this way, you will get a message and you have to click on accept. And that way, the other person can now connect to your desktop or your laptop or a PC. Now, how can we actually do this without having to accept the invite each time? There's actually a way to do this. And that's actually very cool. So if you want to go to the three or the four lines at the top right corner and then go to settings, if you go to access over here, you have unattended access and you can set a password. Now, if you set a password, uh, which we can do right over here, we can also change the permission profile, unattended access, default screen sharing, full access or unattended access. We can change that to whatever we would like to. But if you now apply this, um, all the other person has to do is copy your address. So the other address, which is right over here. And then instead of you on this PC that I'm currently on having to accept it, the other person simply has to enter the correct password. And by that way, they can always access this desktop. So let's say I always have my PC on at home and I'm um, away, let's say in school or at work. Then what I can do is simply add, uh, enter the address on my phone, for example, simply enter the password and I'll be able to access my desktop from my phone uh, without having to accept the invite on this PC. That's pretty cool. Now, something which also shows over here, allow others, other devices to save login tokens for this client. So it says when activated, other devices may save authentication data for this desk. All following sessions can then be established without retyping the password, which means that if, uh, let's say on my phone, I entered the password once, then I can always easily um, access this again, simply by checking this but if you don't want that and you have to re-enter the password each time, then turn it off. So this is how to connect any desk to another computer. I hope this video helped you out. Let me know.